Good morning friends I hope everyone is doing well I request everyone to watch my videos in a sequence for better understanding If you really like my teaching please press the like button share the videos with your friends subscribe to my channel and even press the bell button to get the regular updates In the last video we have discussed about the Manchester encoding with respect to the JE Thomas representation and IEEE 802.3 representation if you have not watched that video i request you to go and watch that video and come back to this video for better understanding in this video i want to discuss about differential manchester encoding first let me discuss about the differential manchester encoding with respect to je thomas and IEEE 802.3 representation then i will discuss one example so that you will understand the concept in a better way so in manchester encoding also we have je thomas representation and ieee 802.3 representation similarly in differential manchester encoding also we have two representation one is je thomas representation and second one is ieee 802.3 representation now please remember one thing when it comes to the manchester encoding the one is represented as in je thomas as like this zero is represented as like this am i right one is represented as two bit interval as 10 and zero is represented as two bit interval 01 and it comes to ieee 802.3 one is represented as low to high and zero is represented as high to low am i right so the same is applied for differential manchester encoding for the first bit is it clear suppose if you have 1010 the first bit is 1 so if you are following the je thomas first let me discuss about the je thomas then we'll go for ieee 802.3 okay now in je thomas the one will be represented like this and zero will be represented like this so this bit is representation for the first bit then you can ask me sir from second bit what will happen from the second bit from the second bit if it you get a zero there is a presence of transition from second bit if you have a zero there is a presence of transition what is the meaning of this presence of transition i will discuss with an example don't worry if it is a one then it is a absence of transition okay if it is one from the second bit see in this case here if you see that second bit is zero then you have to go for a presence of transition then you have to represent then if it is a one there is a absence of transition you have to represent i think you did not understand what is this presence of transition and absence of transition don't worry i will discuss with one example how to represent differential manchester encoding with je thomas representation then we will go for ieee 802.3 now let's take that i want to represent 10010 okay now if you see that we have to represent in two bits let me discuss about the je thomas okay now je thomas the first bit as one so how to represent the first bit let me write it as high and low so first bit is one so how to represent one in je thomas it is z shape so represent like this okay so the first bit is completed now come to this one zero it is a second bit from second bit onwards if you get a zero there is a presence of transition meaning is that you are here presence of transition means you have to go here are you able to understand you have to go here or let me represent with a different color so that you will understand okay presence of transition you have to go here okay are you able to understand then you have to represent the zero so you will represent like this means you have one represented one so it is 10 one, 
then you got a zero so there is a presence of transition meaning is that from low you have to go to high then you have to represent is it clear are you able to understand then again there is a zero then if again zero is there there is a presence of transition if there is a presence of transition from here to here you have to shift from here to here you have to shift and then you have to represent are you able to understand okay then you got a one one is what absence of transition meaning is that you are here you should not move anywhere and you have to represent means absence of transition from here you have to go back okay now again there is a zero zero means what presence of transition meaning is that you are here you have to go means high to low you have to go and then you have to represent is it clear so this is the way differential manchester encoding will be represented according to j e thomas now we will discuss about i triple e 802.3 representation okay in i triple e 802.3 even in the manchester encoding one will be represented as a reverse of z some people will call this as reverse of z then this is z but what is this one means it is go from low to high and zero will be represent as two bit interval from high to low so even in the differential manchester encoding in the i triple e 802.3 the first bit if it is a one i will represent this one if it is zero i will represent this one from second bit onwards i will use the same principle meaning is that if there is a zero presence of transition if it is a one absence of transition okay are you able to understand so now we will discuss the i triple e 802.3 representation for this example if you see that the first bit is one the first bit is one means you have to represent like this so you have a one and you have a zero the first bit is one so you will represent reverse of z okay are you able to understand now the second bit is zero second bit is zero means presence of transition presence of transition means you are at the high you have to go to low so this is what from high to low you are going and then you have to represent from low to high you have to go is it clear then again you got a zero again there is a presence of transition presence of transition means you are at the high again you go to the low okay then you represent this one like low to high you have to go is it clear are you able to understand so 100 i have represented according to i triple e 802.3 representation now there is a one one means what absence of transition meaning is that you are in the high be there and move it from high to low and zero zero is what again there is a presence of transition you are at the low go to the high means from zero to one you have to go then you have to represent so this is the way we will represent one zero zero one zero according to je thomas and i triple e 802.3 representation so i hope you have understood differential manchester encoding if you still have any doubts related to this concept feel free to ask me in the comment session i will try to clear your doubts in less than 24 hours if you really like my teaching please press the like button share the videos with your friends subscribe to my channel and even press the bell button to get the regular updates thank you for watching my video have a nice day